So the goal of this mini lecture is to acquaint you with how to graph a line when you're given the equation of that line in slope-intercept form. So first you need to recognize what is slope-intercept form, and that is when the equation of the line has the form of y equals mx plus b. m and b in this form are constants, and they also stand for something. So m corresponds to the slope of the line, and B is the y-intercept. So this is why it's slope-intercept form. Uh, remember that the slope is the... the slope is the change in the vertical direction of the line over the change in the horizontal direction. Also, you might be familiar with rise over run. And the y-intercept is where the line passes through the y-axis. And so, if you were to plot this point, then it would always be zero. And when you're looking at this form of uh, the equation of the line, then the y-intercept would be 0 and b. And so you can plot this point and then use the slope that's given to you to graph a line. And so let's get some practice with that. Here in the first one, this is the slope-intercept form of the line equation. And we're asked to find the y-intercept and the slope. And so that information is pretty much given to us, well the slope is at least, it is 2 over 1, or 2. So that's our slope. And then our y-intercept is going to be 0, and then whatever b is, plus 1. And so now, if we wanted to graph the line, this is our y-intercept, we would plot this point. So if we let each line on the grid be 1, and this would be 0, 1 right here. And then using the slope, we can find other points on the line. So we would go up to 1, 2 over 1. You can connect those two to make the line or find other points, which is what I'm going to do. Up 2 over 1. Now we have a good number of points to try to draw as straight a line as possible. I don't have a ruler, so I'm eyeballing it. And so that would be the graphed line that is described by y equals 2x plus 1, along with our slope and y-intercept. Let's do another one. So we're given it in slope-intercept form again. We need to find the y-intercept and the slope. Slope is 3 halves. And our y-intercept is 0 minus 3. So now we can use that information to graph our line. So if we plot 0 minus 3, 0 minus 1 minus 2 minus 3, and then our slope is positive 3 halves, so we will go up 3, 1, 2, 3, over 2. Up 3, 2, 3, over 2. We can draw the line straight, and that's the line described by that equation. So a slope-intercept form, your uh, constants that are given to you in that form are your slope and your uh, y-coordinate of the y-intercept. And once you've gotten your y-intercept point, uh, you can plot that and then use the slope value to plot and find other points on the line. And that slope-intercept form 